It's a brand new day at Construction HQ and everyone's excited to start work. But Mr. Rubble looks so tired. Oops, Daisy didn't mean to knock over all the plans. There, today's plans. But something's wrong. That playhouse doesn't look right. Oh well, if that's what the plans say, that's what they'll build. Now everyone's hard at work. But oh dear, Mr. Rubble is so sleepy. Surely no one will notice if he has a short nap. But Diggly can't figure this out. Something is definitely wrong with these plans. But what is it? There. The playhouse is nearly finished. They just need a few finishing touches. But oh no! It doesn't stand up properly. This isn't right at all. Here's Mrs. Skip. Looks like she's trying to say something. Hmm, that sign can spin upside down. That's it. The playhouse plans are upside down. That's why it looks all wrong. Now there's just one thing left to do. Three, two, one, jump! There! That woke Mr. Rubble up. But the playhouse is the right way up now. Good job, everyone. It's another sunny day at Construction HQ. I wonder what they're building today. Oh, nice. A barn. This looks like a good spot to start building. First, they need to lay these planks down. Haha! Nice one, Bum. But what's this? A bunny? Oh no! They're building the barn all over the bunny's home. But I don't think the crew have noticed. The bunnies are definitely not happy. What are they going to do? This bunny has jumped up onto the bricks. What is she doing? She's trying to take one of the bricks. Oh, here comes Bump. I don't think he noticed the bunny. Now Daisy has put some pipes down. And that bunny has pushed them over. And now the bunny has taken that pipe. What are they up to? Now Diggly is laying out his tools. But one of the bunnies is moving his hammer. And now they're moving his screwdriver too. Diggly doesn't get it. Where did his tools go? The whole construction crew are very confused. How do things keep going missing? It's such a mystery. Wait! Now they know the bunnies are the ones moving everything. But why? Oh! They've moved everything into another field. They want the crew to build the barn over there instead, so it's not on top of their rabbit holes. Now Daisy gets it. Now the crew have moved all the building materials into the other field, just like the bunnies wanted. In no time at all, the barn is all finished, all good in the new field. The bunnies are so happy. Well done, team. It's another sunny day at Construction HQ. I wonder what Mr. Rubble has in store today. Wow, they're building a crazy golf course. They're almost done in no time. Diggly and Daisy are putting in the finishing touches. Great, the windmill is in place. Now it's time to test it out. Mr. Rubble is going first. He's taking it very seriously. He hits the ball. It rolls over the hills. Loops the loop. Goes round the roundabout. Through the pipe. And, hang on, where is the ball gone? Aha, there it is. That's not right, it's gone off the course. Diggly hits the ball back up the chute. 
He's plugging the pipe with a cork to stop it from happening again. Very clever, Diggly. But where's it gone? Ouch! Watch out, Mr. Rubble! Mr. Rubble hits the ball around the bend. Now the windmill, but it's spinning way too fast. Watch out, everyone! Hmm, maybe they should change the speed of the windmill. There, that's better. Mr. Rubble tries again. And it's straight through and in the hole. Nice work, Mr. Rubble. It's Diggly's turn. The ball goes over the hills, loops the loop, round the roundabout, through the pipe, under the windmill. Wow, it's a hole in one. Now it's Daisy's turn. Whoa, slow down, Daisy. The ball bounces off the rock and hits Mr. Rubble. It bounces off the windmill and it lands in the hole. Hooray for Daisy. The gang are getting ready for Halloween. And today, they're building a pumpkin stand at the farm. Diggly is putting on the finishing touches. Oh look, it's Terry Tractor. He looks very happy with his new stand. Oops, all the pumpkins are falling. Oh dear. Daisy is covered in pumpkin. She looks a bit scary. She looks like a pumpkin monster. Look, it's Buster and Scout. Ah! Daisy has scared them away. Hmm, it's given Daisy an idea. Buster and Scout are terrified of the pumpkin monster. There it is! Diggly knows it's only Daisy. And it's given him an idea for a prank as well. Daisy is trying to scare Diggly. But what's that? Boo! Don't worry, Daisy. It was just Scout, Diggly and Buster, dressed up like pumpkins. Here's Terry the tractor to check up on them. What's all this? What a scary bunch! Terry is rewarding them all for their hard work with a fruit basket. Yum, yum. Today the construction crew are going to build a canal. That will be great fun. First they need to dig a trench for the water. Bump and CJ want to help, but looks like Diggly and Daisy have it covered. Maybe they don't need Bump and CJ. In no time at all, the trench is dug. Good job everyone. Daisy's ready. <laughs> and smash. Here comes the water. It'll reach Diggly and Mr. Rubble any second. Any second. Where is it? There must be a blockage somewhere. Diggly's taking a look. Look, it's spilling out over there. Quick, Daisy needs to fix it. Oh dear, how will they plug this gap? <gasps> CJ of course, she can use her cement to fix the leak. Good job everyone. But now look, that rock is blocking the canal. That rock is too heavy for Daisy to move. But here comes Bump. He can move that. Hooray! Good work. 
there. At last, the water has filled up the canal. Ah. <laughs> they couldn't have done it without CJ and Bump's help. Good teamwork. It's a boiling hot day at Construction HQ, and the gang are very hot and bothered. But there's no time to rest. <laughs> They've got a busy day ahead. What's Daisy spotted outside? Oh no! It's a fire! And it set off the fire alarm! Here comes Ashley the fire truck. Can she put the fire out? Sure she can. Phew! Hooray for Ashley! And off she goes to help some more people across town. Bye, Ashley! Thank you! Oh no! Another fire started. And there goes the alarm! It's even bigger this time! Where's Ashley the fire truck? Oh no! Don't worry, Diggly has a plan. He's filling up his digger with water. He's trying to put out the fire. Good idea, Diggly. Mr. Rubber wants to help too. Whoops, be careful, CJ. CJ has loaded up her cement mixer with water. Watch your water on the floor, Mr. Rubble. Whoops. Oh no, the fire is spreading towards the building. What are they going to do? Daisy's got a plan. She knocked the tower into the wood and stopped the fire spreading. Hooray for Daisy! Splash! The fire is all gone. And here's Ashley. Don't worry, Ashley. The fire is out. Even if they did make a bit of a mess. The whole construction crew are getting ready for today's job. They're building that crumbly old building. Uh -huh. huh? That can't be right. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, they're demolishing the building. <gasps> Daisy is so excited. Soon enough, it's time to get to work. <laughs> the building looks like it could fall down any moment. It'll be safer to knock it down. Everyone is ready to get started. But wait! Stop everyone! There's a little kitten beside it. Oh no! The kitten could get hurt if they knock it down now. Phew! Diggly stopped them just in time. They need to get the kitten out of harm's way. She's so cute. Ooh! I think Mr. Rubble's afraid of cats. The kitten ran back inside. Oh dear, they can't knock down the building with the kitten inside. Diggly's trying to get her to come out with some milk. Daisy wants to pet the kitten, but Diggly thinks that will frighten her. Oh no, Daisy accidentally hit the building. I think it's going to collapse, but the cat is still inside. What will they do? Maybe Mr. Rubble can help, but he'll have to face his fear of cats. <gasps> Mr. Rubble is small enough to fit inside. Phew! Mr. Rubble saved the kitten, and just in time. That was a close one. Mr. Rubble was very brave to rescue the kitten. I think he's got over his fear of cats now. He's made a friend. It's a beautiful sunny day at the beach. Uh. The construction crew are on holiday. Yippee! Diggly and Daisy are playing tag. What's that? It's seaweed. And it's given Diggly a great idea. They've collected some materials. What are they planning to build? Aha! A beach hut! What a great idea! It's almost complete. But it is missing a roof. 
Oh. Not to worry. <laughs> Daisy has found a large sheet of metal they can use. Whoa! Oh. Oh. Steady, Daisy. It's quite tricky to carry. Watch out! Slow down, Daisy! Be careful! Oh no! Daisy is hurt! Amber the ambulance is here to check that Daisy's okay! That was quite a bump! Phew! She's okay! That's much better! They still need to add the roof on. But now Daisy is a bit scared. Diggly isn't strong enough to carry it. But if they work together, they can do it. Hooray! Watch out for the seaweed. Daisy didn't give up. And now they've done it! Well done, Daisy! <laughs> Mr Rubble and Mrs Skip are enjoying the shade! <laughs> it's a really sunny day at Construction HQ. All the crew are having fun playing with a beach ball. Ha! <laughs> <laughs> nice one, Mr Rubble! Now today, they're putting up some traffic lights. In no time at all, they're nearly done! Daisy's just putting the last traffic light up. And now Diggly has to plug them in. There, the lights are all turning on. Oh, they've gone out. Back at HQ, Mr. Rubble's playing with the ball. What's happening to the lights? Now Mr. Rubble is stuck in the dark. Hmm, the power has all gone. That's very strange. Here's the electricity cable. It looks okay. I wonder where it leads. Diggly's going to follow it. Mr. Rubble is still stuck in the dark. Diggly and Daisy are following the cable all through the construction site. Oops! It's leading them right through this muddy puddle. Yuck! And even under this archway. Look out, Daisy! But where does it lead? Look! An electricity generator. Look at all that smoke. It must have broken down. That's why the power cut out. How will they get electricity now? Wait, I think Daisy has a plan. The sun. They can use solar panels to make power from the sunshine. Very clever, guys. Daisy puts the last one in place. With all those panels, they should have lots of power. CJ's trying the switch. Hooray! The lights are back on! It worked! Good job! Oh, Mr Rubble has got into a real mess while he was stuck in the dark. Today, Mr Rubble has an exciting plan for the crew. Hang on, that's not the right plan. Aha! There it is! They're building a park. The crew are ready to get started. First, they need to knock down the old building. That's an easy task for Daisy. She's nearly finished knocking it down. Huh? What's that? Little frogs? Where did you come from? This park is their home. The crew can't build here. Where would the frogs live? Don't worry, gang. Bump has an idea. He's distracting Mr. Rubble. While Diggly and Daisy make some changes to Mr. Rubble's plan. They're building a new home for these five little frogs. Sorry, Mr. Rubble. First, Diggly is cleaning up the pond, making it nice and clean. The frogs look very happy about this. Next, they've got to lay some fresh grass. Whoa! Great teamwork, guys! 
Oh no! <gasps> Mr. Rubble has realized their plan to add a pond. He's not happy. Well, well, well. He likes the changes after all. The park looks amazing. And the frogs love it. What a beautiful new home for some very cheeky little frogs. It's a winter's day at the construction HQ and all the crew are excited to get to work. Oh, today they're building a windmill. Hooray! But, oh dear, those dark clouds don't look good. They'd better get to work fast. In no time at all, the windmill is almost finished. Now the sails are on too. Now to test it. But wait, it's snowing. It's snowing a lot. Oh dear, Mr. Rubble says they need to go inside or they'll catch colds. Diggly wants to play in the snow, but he has to go inside. The next morning, everyone is ready to get back to work. Oh look, there's so much snow outside. Oops, I don't think that'll work, Mr. Rubble. Diggly can dig a path through the snow. There, now they need to reach the windmill. Almost there. There, but the button is frozen up. This looks like a job for Daisy. There, no problem. Whoa! The windmill is blowing all the snow away. Great work, everyone. Now they have time to play. They can all slide down the snow drifts. Hooray! The crew are arriving at Construction HQ. Hmm. I wonder what's in store today. Uh -huh. Wow, they're painting a rainbow building. This is going to be a lot of fun. <laughs> Look at all those ah. colourful paints. <gasps> Time to get started. It's purple first. Diggly and Daisy are on two platforms that are connected. Daisy is starting with red at the top. She's lowering down her platform. But oops, it's made Diggly go up. Hmm, that's not right. Diggly lowers his platform again, but that has lifted Daisy's up. Oh dear, this isn't going to plan. Whoa, watch out Mr. Rubble. Mr. Rubble is covered in paint. Daisy looks determined to fix this. Up she goes. But that sends Diggly down again. Look out! Oh dear! This is getting very messy. How are Diggly and Daisy going to fix this? Oh! Diggly has realised that they're both connected and they need to work together as a team. That's much better. Great job, guys. Wow, that building looks amazing. What a great day's work. Uh-oh. Look out for that paint, Mr. Rubble. Not again. What are the crew working on today? They're fixing up a school soccer field. Yippee! It's looking a bit overgrown. And the goals are falling apart. Time to get to work. Bump is laying new grass and CJ is painting fresh white lines. Whilst Diggly and Daisy are fixing the goals. 
<laughs> Great teamwork, gang. And it looks good as new. Time to test it out. Mr. Rubble is referee, and it's boys versus girls. Let's play. Diggly kicks to Bump, and Bump charges for the goal. Whoa! Steady there, Bump. That was a very big kick. <gasps> Whoa! Bump really wants to win. Daisy passes to CJ. But Bump tackles CJ to the ground. Oh dear! That wasn't very nice, Bump. He should have been more friendly. Mr. Rubble is given Bump a yellow card. He doesn't look very happy. Diggly is in goal. But Bump pushes Diggly out the way. Poor Diggly. CJ scores. <gasps> Hooray! It's okay, Bump. It's just a game. Diggly passes to Bump. And Bump is about to charge. But Bump realises he's been too rough. And he needs to be kinder. Bump passes. And Diggly scores! See? Everything is much better when you play nicely together. It's a new day on the construction site. Oh dear! Bump is so slow. He's going to be late. Mr. Rubble doesn't like it when people are late. Today they're going to build a sand pit. How exciting! Diggly has dug the hole in no time at all. Oh dear, it takes Bump a long time to get anywhere. Now they just need to fill the hole with sand. But oh dear, Bump has to go all the way over there to get it. Bump looks very gloomy. Everyone is so much faster than him. But what's this? Diggly has an idea. Oh, he's making some changes to Bump's engine. Now Bump is so much faster. Whoa! Watch out, Mr. Rubble. Uh-oh, Bump is speeding around out of control. Look out for that pile of dirt. Oh dear. Poor Bump. He's just not designed to go fast. Diggly is going to change him back. Later on, Diggly and Daisy are trying to load the sand into the sand pit. But it's taking them forever. But wait. With his big scoop, Bump can do that in no time. He may not move fast, but he can move things faster than anyone else. Nice work, Bump. He's very useful just the way he is. It's a very windy day at Construction HQ. I wonder what they'll be building today. Oh wow, the towpath for the canal. That looks amazing. To build a towpath, they'll need paving slabs. Here comes Rocky the riverboat to deliver them. Ooh, it is windy today. Rocky loves to listen to music on his big headphones. There, now to unload the slabs. Gently there. Thanks, Rocky. Now the crew can get to work on the towpath. But the wind is picking up. Oh no! Mr. Rubble's hat. It's landed on the back of Rocky. Not to worry. Mrs. Skip can get it. She's even trying it on. Oh no! Rocky is sailing on. But he doesn't realise Mrs. Skip is still on the back. Come back, Rocky. He can't hear them because of his big headphones. What's Mrs. Skip going to do? She can't get carried off down the river. Who knows where she'll end up? They have to get Rocky's attention somehow. 
Watch where you're going, Mr. Rubble. Oops, Mr. Rubble hit a box. Diggly is racing ahead to try and stop Rocky. Maybe he can get his attention with this ball. Good thing Mrs. Skip has the helmet. Hmm, what's Daisy up to? She's brought the stack of slabs. I wonder what her plan is. She's hopping up on top. Hooray! She saved Mrs. Skip. She's back on dry land, safe and sound. For you. Later on and the towpath is almost finished. Rocky is drifting past again, still listening to his music. He never knew anything was wrong. It's a summery day at Construction HQ. What's happening? Mr. Rubble seems very nervous. They're off on holiday, to the beach. Hooray! Mr. Rubble was just tricking them. Diggly is building a sandcastle. Whoa! Daisy's sandcastle is huge. Diggly wishes his sandcastle was that big. Mr. Rubble is happily sunbathing. Oops! Who was that? It's Buster and Scout. They're on holiday too. Diggly is finishing off his new sandcastle. That's great, Diggly. Daisy asked Buster to help her build an even bigger one. Look out, Mrs. Skip. Oops. Wow. Look at that. Their castle even has a moat. Diggly and Scout think they can do better. Wow. That's amazing. Hang on a second. Looks like the tide is coming in. It could ruin their sand castles. Quick everyone, they need to work together to build a wall. Mr. Rubble is fast asleep. The tide, quick! Oh no, Mrs. Skip, watch out. Phew. They're okay. What an eventful day at the beach. Oh, Diggly has a new book. Everyone wants to see. It's all about dinosaurs. But Mr. Rubble is waiting. It's time to start work. Today they're building a roundabout. Soon everyone is hard at work. Diggly just wants to read his book. But now isn't the time. There's work to do. Wait, what's Diggly found? It looks like some old bones. I wonder what they are. Daisy's collecting them up. There are so many. Oh, I think they're dinosaur bones. Now they just need to put them together like a jigsaw puzzle. Everyone is helping put the dinosaur bones together. Done. Uh, that doesn't look right. Oh dear, they'll have to try again. What about now? <laughs> no, that's not right either. But wait, on the front cover. That's it. It's a T-Rex skeleton. Now they know what it is, they can put it together properly. Nice work, everyone. <laughs> Now it can stand in the middle of the roundabout. Look, it's Diggly. I think he wants to lift that big girder. There's Johnny. He has no problem lifting heavy loads. He's tall and strong. But Diggly is only little. 
And that girder is very heavy. Ah, oh, Dickley can't reach high enough. Poor Dickley. Here's Dozer. He wants to cheer Dickley up. Being big and strong isn't everything. Everybody has different things they're good at. There's no need to be upset. <laughs> I think Digley has a plan. He's got a barrel. And Dozer has a plank of wood. Now Digley's up on the roof. Dozer's put a crate of bricks on the plank. Is it a seesaw? Oh, I see. It's a catapult. They can use it to bounce bricks up onto the roof. Very clever, Digley. Johnny is still lifting the heavy bricks up onto the roof. But look, Digley can bounce them up easily. He's using his brain to solve a problem. Look, now Daisy wants a turn. It's so much fun using Digley's new invention. They'll have moved all the bricks in no time. Digley may not be the strongest or the tallest, but he can be a very big help if he tries hard. <laughs> well done, Digley. It's the construction crew. They're finishing their work on a new tunnel. Oh, what's that sound? There's been a huge explosion down the mountain. Look. Huge rolling snowballs. It's an avalanche. CJ tells the other workers to get inside the tunnel for safety. Dozer pushes Johnny in. There's no time to waste. Digley rushes to Daisy and tells her to get into the tunnel. The two get in just in time and the snow crashes down behind them. It's really dark in the tunnel. Digley grabs a lantern and goes to investigate the snowed in entrance. It looks too thick to dig through. Even Johnny can't dig through it. Digley starts investigating the rest of the tunnel. He can spot something up ahead. There are some train carriages on the tracks. The tracks lead deeper into the tunnel. Digley thinks that they can get on the train and escape out the other end of the tunnel. The construction crew have all jumped on the train. Dozer is nervous to be at the front. Johnny gives them a push and they're off. Whoa, it's like a giant roller coaster. Look at them go. Whoosh. This looks like fun. Uh-oh, there is a snow blockage that they're going to crash into. The construction crew burst through the snow. They're outside and safe. Good job, Digley and Dozer. Look, it's the construction crew and they're building a castle. Digley is directing Daisy as she lifts a big heavy block and puts it in place. CJ squirts the cement and done. One, two, three, four, five blocks on one side and one, two on the other. They're going to need some more blocks. Go, go, Dozer. One, two, three blocks across the drawbridge. Good job, Dozer. Oh no. It's a scary shark. Oh. Whoops. One of the blocks has fallen into the water. Poor Dozer, it was just an accident. Now Daisy has to lift the blocks into place. One, two blocks are left. Mm. They're really heavy. Careful Daisy. Oops, they'll smash up. Oh no, Daisy's music got turned up really loud. She dropped the blocks. 
for you. Diggly caught one of the blocks, but oh dear, the other mashed. How many are left? One, two, three, four, five on one side. One, two, three on the other. Oh dear, they don't match. But wait, I think Diggly has an idea. What's he up to? He's taking a block from the taller tower. Five minus one is four. Now he's adding the block to the shorter tower. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. They match. <laughs> nice work, Diggly. Diggly and Daisy are so excited for Halloween. They can't wait to go trick or treating tonight. Oh, but, oh dear. Mr. Rubble says they've still got work to do. Diggly and Daisy are working hard on the construction site. There's Buster and Scout going trick or treating. Diggly and Daisy wish that they could join them. Here comes Mrs. Skip. Look, she's given them Halloween masks. That's given Daisy an idea. What's that noise? Trick or treat! Daisy is trick-or-treating Mr. Rubble and he doesn't recognise her. He's given her some sweets. Maybe they can go trick-or-treating after all. Uh. Mm. <laughs> now Diggly's going to try. Trick or treat! <laughs> Mr. Rubble doesn't recognise Diggly either, so gives him some sweets. But, hmm, that trick or treater looked kind of familiar. Mr. Rubble's going to investigate. Uh oh, Daisy's hiding, Diggly's running. Mr. Rubble thinks something funny is going on. A trail of sweets, he's chasing after Diggly. Oops! Oh dear, Mr. Rubble found them. He caught them playing instead of working. But... Aw, he's brought them some more sweets. Mr. Rubble is a big softy, really. Now he's letting Diggly and Daisy go trick-or-treating. Happy Halloween, everyone. It's a new day at the construction site. I wonder what they'll build today. Ooh, yeah. Mr. Rubble says they're going to build a car wash. <laughs> Amazing! Everyone's working as a team to build the car wash. Now they just need to add soap. Oh dear, that barrel doesn't look like soap. But Bump hasn't noticed. Here's Mr. Rubble to take a look. Oh dear, he's all dirty. Not to worry, he can get all clean in the new car wash. Uh, oh dear, something's gone wrong. It turned Mr. Rubble green. I don't think he's noticed. They can't let him look in the mirror. Diggly's investigating. There's the problem. Bump put paint in the car wash, not soap. They'll need to paint Mr. Rubble back to the right colour. Splosh! Daisy splashed Mr. Rubble with mud. Now he'll need to use the car wash again. In Mr. Rubble goes. Oh no, now Mr. Rubble is blue. Quick! They need to stop him before he looks in the mirror. Splash! Nice work, Daisy. Now he needs to use the car wash again. Diggly's putting in another paint can. I hope this is the right colour. Into the car wash Mr. Rubble goes. Phew, he's back to his normal colour at last and squeaky clean too. Thank goodness. Looking good Mr. Rubble. Good job everyone. It's a bright sunny day at the construction HQ. 
Aw, Bump hasn't quite woken up yet. He doesn't like mornings. Here are today's plans. They're going to build a pond. How exciting! This will be so much fun! First, it's up to Diggly to dig the hole. Good job, Diggly. Next, Bump pushes the dirt away and Daisy puts some stones around the edge of the pond. Great! Now all that's left is to fill it up with water. Better get out of the way, Diggly. Bump's turned on the tap and the water runs through the hose. Hmm, Daisy doesn't like that stone. Oh no! The stone landed on the hose! Now the water can't get through. Quick! They need to do something. Daisy's got an idea. She's going to hit the stone. Splash! Uh-oh. Now the hose has sprung a leak. The water is spraying everywhere. But Mrs Skip knows what to do. They can use a band-aid to stick the hole shut. There. Good job, everyone. Now the water can flow again. Mr Rubble wonders where the water's got to. Oops! Mr Rubble has ended up in the pond. But that's okay. He thinks it's funny too. Splash! Great work, guys! It's a bright new day at Construction HQ. Diggly and Daisy are so excited to see what they'll build today. Oh, wow! A Ferris wheel! This will be so much fun! Now they're at the fairground. The wheel is almost ready. Daisy is just lifting it up. Boing! There, it's finished. But who's going to take a ride in it first? Hooray! Diggly is having a go. Daisy throws the switch and up Diggly goes. But uh-oh, something is wrong. Oh dear, the wheel stopped. Diggly is stuck at the top. There must be a way to get him down. Daisy has an idea. Whoosh! A pillow to jump on. I don't think that's going to work. Daisy will have to think of something else. She's off again. Whoosh! Look, now Daisy is trying to pull the wheel round, but it's no good, it's stuck tight. But now she has another idea. Blocks? I wonder what Daisy is up to. Whoa, she's built steps all the way up to Diggly. Here's Mrs Skip. Oh wow, she's got a ramp to put on top of the blocks. They could turn it into a giant slide. Whee! That was so much fun! Diggly is fixing the wheel controls. Good as new. The Ferris wheel is ready. But look, Diggly and Daisy just want to use it to slide down the slide. It looks like so much fun. They haven't just built one fairground ride, they've built two. It's a brand new day at Construction HQ. All the vehicles are excited to get to work. I wonder what they're building today. Whoa, a pancake shack. Oh dear. Diggly doesn't look his usual happy self. I wonder what's wrong. Oh no, Diggly is sick. He can't work today. He'll have to stay home. Time to start work. The first thing to do is dig the foundations. But without Diggly, how will they dig? That's not working at all. Daisy can't dig the way Diggly does.
Maybe this girl will help. Oops! Mother's going everywhere and Daisy can't keep the drill still. This isn't working either. Oh dear, oh dear. Mm. <gasps> Diggly is watching from HQ. He really wants to help, but he's still feeling sick. Here's Mrs Skip with some medicine. That should help. Back on the building site. They still haven't dug the foundations. Oh dear. Splat! Wait, this plank of wood throws dirt into the air. Like a spade. Maybe they can use this to dig the foundations. Yes, it works! Good work, Daisy. She's found a way to dig in her own way. In no time at all. There, the Pancake Shack is finished. Aww, Daisy has brought some pancakes to Diggly to make him feel better. What a good friend. Mmm, delicious. It's a fun snowy day at Construction HQ. I wonder what they're building today. An ice rink? Amazing! Here's the frozen pond. To turn it into a skating rink, they need to put up the soft safety barriers. Uh oh, Bump's moving the snow, but he's not seen Mr. Rubble. Oops, Mr. Rubble is on the ice. His wheels can't grip. He's sliding. Quick, Diggly and Daisy can move the barrier so he doesn't crash. Phew, nice work. But now Mr. Rubble is sliding towards the market stall. Mrs. Skip has to bounce him back. Good job, Mrs. Skip. Bounce, bounce. Mr. Rubble's going back and forth like a ping pong ball. But I think Diggly has a plan. They can bounce him into this pile of snow. Daisy's bouncing him towards the snow pile. Whoosh! Is Mr. Rubble okay? Ah, oh, there he is! Good job everyone! Now the ice rink can be finished in no time! Diggly and Daisy are having fun skating on it! But what's this? Skates? Now Mr Rubble can join in and skate too! Whoa, whoa there! He's got it! It's so much fun to go ice skating! It's Christmas time at Construction HQ and everyone is really excited but first they have work to do. They need to build a present wrapping machine. The presents go in here and come out here. But wait! They're building this for Santa? Diggly and Daisy are so excited they might even get to meet Santa. Wow, in no time at all, the present wrapping machine is almost finished. Now it's time to test it. Diggly pulls the lever. Mr Rubble puts the toy on the conveyor belt. And out it comes all wrapped up. Pop! Oops, uh oh. Now the machine is running backwards. Oh dear, oh dear. Diggly's trying to turn the machine off. Oh no, now it's running faster. It's sucking the toys up. Oh no, it sucks Mr. Robin up. Diggly and Daisy are trying to stop it. But they're not working together. Mr. Rubble's wrapped up like a present. But who's this? It's Santa. He can fix this mess. Santa snaps his fingers and... Phew, the machine is fixed. There's Mr. Rubble. He's still wrapped up. Phew, that's much better. Diggly and Daisy are sorry the machine went wrong. But it's okay. Santa knows just how to cheer them up. 
<laughs> Whoa! A present each for Diggly and Daisy. Amazing! <laughs> Merry Christmas, everyone! <laughs> everyone is so excited for Christmas at the construction site. But there's still work to do. Today, they're building a pylon. But Mrs. Skip has plans for a Christmas tree. Wow! <laughs> but Mr. Rubble says that there's no time for Christmas trees. They have work to do. Everyone is so disappointed. Soon, everyone is working hard on building the pylon. But what's Mrs. Skip up to? Oh! She started to make a Christmas tree in secret. But she needs a bit of help. Everyone is still hard at work. Oh, Diggly's telling Daisy about the secret Christmas tree. They're building it out of rubbish. It's a recycled Christmas tree. There's Bump and CJ. They can help too! Everyone's finding things they can recycle for the Christmas tree. Mr. Rubble wonders what everyone's up to. Some planks, green paint, the tree is really taking shape. Ornaments and a satellite disc for the star. Hooray! And the pylon is finished too. Good job, everyone. But Mr. Rubble wonders where everyone's got to. Oh. oh, he's found the secret tree. What's Mr. Rubble doing? Oh, he's helping. He's plugging in the lights. He's not angry. He's happy. Merry Christmas, everyone. It's the construction crew. Hard at work as usual. Good work, Diggly and Johnny. Hmm. I wonder what's in that crate. Whoa. A yellow circle, a red triangle, and a blue square. Oh. Diggly is right. The blue square will fit at the bottom of the tower. Go on, guys. Put it in place. Look out, Dozer. Oh, well, the square is in place at least. Here comes CJ. A little cement. And it's a door. I don't think Dozer liked being shut inside. Now the red triangle. Where does that belong? Aha! At the top of the flagpole. Go on, Diggly. Raise the flag. There. Well done, Diggly. Now just the yellow circle to go. I wonder where that goes. Oh, it's a clock, which means it belongs at the very top of the clock tower. Somebody will have to go all the way up there. Be brave, Diggly. It's high up, but you can do it. Ready, everyone? Heave! <gasps> up and up we go. Don't look down, Diggly. Almost there. Keep pulling. There. Careful, Diggly. Just gently put the clock in place. Well done. You did it. What a brave little digger Diggly is. See you next time. Ooh. <laughs> Ooh.